this TA Tech Tip, we'll be filling the relative humidity chambers of the RH perfusion ampule for the TAM calorimeters. So the RH ampule is delivered with a blunt end needle, and what I did is I put a slight bend in it to make it easier to access the little plugs of the RH ampule. And so what I do is I use the little needle and reach inside the little plug and lift up to take out the little plug. Now you have access to the relative humidity chamber. So I'm going to fill this disposable syringe with about a half a milliliter up to about 0.8 milliliters. You can fill it completely full with 0.8 milliliters of water. And you have to go through an O-ring so you have to be quite careful. But once you find the bottom, put the needle all the way to the bottom and slowly inject the water to fill the humidity chamber. You can return the plug, put it back in place, fill up the one on the bottom, and you're ready for an experiment. So now you have your relative humidity chambers full on your RH ampule, and you're ready to perform your experiments. But you want to remember, after you're done with your experiments and you're ready to pack up the RH perfusion ampule, you want to make sure to empty the relative humidity chambers before putting it back in the box and storing for any amount of time.